Once the Guardian's installed, it's really easy to operate. Simply switch on the power to your boat. If your tag's not already connected, you'll hear it beeping and you'll see it flashing on the switch here. So you switch on your tag, and it simply connects immediately. The Guardian then carries out a 30 second scan for any other OLAS transmitters in the two meter radius. You can connect up to 15 OLAS transmitters so you can cover your crew, your family, your pets and even the OLAS float on attaches up. After the 30 second scan the Guardian tells you how many tags have been connected through a light indication on the switch and a beep from the Guardian. And then if you want to double check how many are connected you simply press the switch once. three beeps, that confirms that three tags are connected up. And then you look back on the switch, it's green, you're tracking and you're good to go. Although not essential, we recommend using the free OLAS app for additional features and to aid in easy setup. You can check your tags here, you've got your battery life, you've got your distance and then you can customise the name here. You can also change the tag so you can disable the cutoff, so you do that for your crew or you can pause the unit completely. So press again. Now, if I was to leave the boat, it wouldn't set off alarm or um, kill the engine. So I will put that back onto full track. You've got the ability to fully pause the app by pressing and holding there. That pauses the whole system. It puts the whole Guardian in pause. So if you come into dock, that's the best way to operate it. You can easily unpause it again by pressing the button. It starts your tracking again. If boating alone, the OLAS app solo mode can be used. This is designed so that it will automatically send a message to a number of your choice with the GPS position and the time and your number of when the incident occurred. So they can try and contact you and contact the Coast Guard if they don't have any luck. Now we've got the Guardian going, I'm just going to do a quick test to make sure it cuts out after two seconds. And then you hear the alarm going off on the phone and the alarm from the Guardian. So first I'm going to cancel it on the phone. It cancels the alarm on both systems and puts it into a pause mode. Once you're in the pause mode and I'm back on board, I simply bring the tag next to the Guardian, press the button once and it simply reconnects it. And you're good to go and start boating again. Switch your engine back on.